a Trevor 3-1 defeat to Man City, but overall there's a lot to take away from that game, isn't there? Um, yeah, definitely. If, if I'm going to summarise the game, I, I thought we started really brightly. Um, I think we lost, probably lost our way a bit when we went 1-0 down. I think it was against the run of things, um, and they obviously capitalised on that period. Um, second half, to be honest with you, I thought we dominated, and we probably looked more likely the two to score. Um, and I think for us, <clears throat> possibly managing the, la the latter periods of a game has not been one of our strong points over the last few weeks and it's something that we've wanted to improve on, starting that second half brightly and finishing the half brightly as well. Um, and we did that today. Um, obviously, no, we don't like losing, um, but I think the girls have accepted this is a process and it's a, it's a new and a young team. And um, yeah, I'm actually really proud of the way that we displayed ourselves today. Was there a change tactically in the second half or was it more a mentality? Um, not so much a change really. We flattened off a little bit. Um, but not not I think to be honest with you, we just you know, we had a chat with each other at half time um, before the gaffers come in um, and just said, look like, stick together and let's start the second half brightly. Um, and it, and yeah, I think the squad's really coming together as a group now. Um, and taking responsibility um, and like I spoke about in the week just about everybody being brave and I thought we were very brave in the second half. I appreciate that overall it doesn't necessarily uh, reflect in the in the result but to uh, keep a clean sheet in that second half and, and actually win the second half does that give you a bit of confidence? Yeah and I think you have to start taking positives from games it gives you a, I think it gives us a great platform going forward into next week's game you know for large periods of this game we've matched and even dominated City so um, we, we that's, that's, that's our aim at the moment to take the positives and build on those and when you when you grow in confidence you know the results start coming again and, and this was always going to be a tough game um, it was never going to be easy and um, so there's lessons to be learned in there but also massive positives for the squad to take. You're saying in midweek about how this season's going to be a big learning curve for some of the young players in the yeah. group. Coming somewhere like this where they're coming up against top pros and going 3-0 down but actually kind of stopping them going in, that's really impressive to see, isn't it? Yeah, absolutely. And like I said, it'll stand them in good stead going forward. You know, um, even the senior players, this is a lot different for us. And like I think as a group, we all, we all want the same thing. So might not be coming as quickly as we'd like to and, and maybe how Brighton is used to um, but definitely the effort intent and intent from the squad is there. Everton next week, it looks like it's an important game now that we're sitting 11th. Every game is important, 